What's up, everybody? I'm do with another YouTube video. So here we are, international now, worldwide. Sync here, this is where it's at. Crypto Muscle. And the Crypto Muscle Network coming to you in this video. As you can see here, the Crypto Muscle Network. As you can see here, the Crypto Muscle Original. This is where you can find the latest and greatest in terms of all the different platforms there are out there right now in terms of uh just things in general you know opinions real stuff right life infused content not just some typical youtuber here's a platform today and this this and this and oh yeah it's doing its thing and that's it you know like there's no substance no no real thoughts to it just just here's here's how it is today and that's it, all right? Me, psh, I'll, I'll trash on other YouTubers. I'll smash on other YouTubers. I'll, I'll let you guys know the real news and information that goes on in some of these platforms, all right? So that's one of those things that I do in this space that no one else does. You know, they just, they just act like they just it's all about platforms, and that's it. But they don't tell you the real stuff that goes on you know, they just want to fake it until it stops making it, right? I mean, come on. That's where you got to wake up and smell the roses here on the reality. And here, here's a case in point. Novatech is dying. Has been dying. And what I've been doing, well, shit, I tell it like it is. No, but you have all these other people that say, oh, yeah, it's it's doing okay. It's going to recover. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. And all this other bullshit. Casualex died a long time ago, almost two years ago now. And I showed you guys that. So I'm just saying, there's a difference. All right, so here it is with uh, last night's of Cryptopia. DeFi night token. Last night, night's of Cryptopia is the metaverse. All right is the blockchain is the metaverse they go hand in hand with each other this is where you find it out here i call this the biggest legacy DeFi project that just came out in 2023 and once this thing takes hold it's going to take over the space it's going to it's going to be pretty damn good but it's already off to a pretty good start in terms of well shit what it has to offer you know so you know you look at the DeFi night token it's on the Binance Smart Chain they're not going to wait around for Pulse Chain to launch like some of these other you know DeFi projects out there and all that they, what, they're going to wait around for D, you know Pulse Chain to launch if it ever launches and then what how long is that going to take you know like we got to start making this shit now. We're not going to sit around and wait forever like some of these other guys. That's where they're dropping the ball right now. All right. And then, you know, on the Binance Smart Chain, it's it's a pretty, it's probably, if not the best of all worlds when it comes to the network that it's on, right? The Binance Smart Chain Network. In terms of speed, relative cost on the, you know, the, gas fees or I you know the network fees I guess you could say and the best of all worlds in that regard and it's a a known a well well known smart chain right blockchain network I guess you could say and you know Ethereum is probably the you know top of its kind but the gas fees are high right and you look at other, you know, networks out there. There's so many of them, yeah. And you know, if you go, if you look at things like Solana, they have issues. You have other alternatives, Polygon Network, Phantom Network. I mean, but they're not bringing it to the dance like Binance Marching has done. They've paved the way to be the blockchain of its kind the the network of its kind and that's why so many projects have been on this binance smart chain ever since they became 
the alternative to the ETH network. So that's where DeFi Night stands, right? And once this thing comes into full play, then you will see what DeFi Night in full utilization can do for you. Right now, they just got staking plans going on. All right, to keep yourselves busy and, uh, you know, filled up with this activity for now while they have all these other pieces come in play and come into place, staking, there's nothing wrong with that. And if you're waiting for this system, this metaverse to launch, that's fine. But you can wait while you're staking. And that's the good part of it. You, you can earn while you wait for this whole metaverse to fully launch. So that's what's pretty cool about it. And while you're waiting to staking away, you can stake the night token to earn more tokens, right? Up to 20% a month while you're waiting. You can also stake your crypto for this waiting period before the whole metaverse comes into play. And that's fine too. Up to 15% a month on the crypto itself. So you can stake all that while you're waiting for this metaverse to come into full play. You know, collect more night tokens. Right now they're valued at 25 cents each. Once that comes into play, the sky's the limit. Who knows what the value is going to be on these night tokens. So just saying, when you do all that, and then once they launch the metaverse, letting this thing come into full play, man, the sky is the limit on what things can happen in this metaverse with these pieces in play, the world that it's in. I guess you could say the universe that it's in, right? And so that's what it's all about here. And you earn staking rewards in BUSD. So no matter what crypto you put in, right? Bitcoin, uh, Litecoin, BUSD, Bitcoin Cash, Zcash, Doge, Ethereum, Dash, um, what is that? J Tron and uh, Binance tokens right Binance coins I mean um, you know you earn up to 15% per month on the real cryptos right $100 minimum and you just earn the rewards but it'll give you in form of BUSD right stable dollar if you are staking in stable coin I'm sorry in uh, the DeFi night coin token here you earn more of those. Huh. Very interesting. Actually, no. You, you just earn more. You just earn everything in BUSD. So if you want to reutilize the night tokens, right, you just put it back into play and get more of those tokens at the current price of 25 cents each. Before it takes off. So everything you're going to earn is in BUSD. Especially even with the, the night token here. And all you got to do is put it back in and get more if you want more night token. So as you can see there, night, multiple coins of stake. Right? So. Last couple months, you've been seeing me when it first came into play back in February what has happened I've gotten two payments now right first month and second month and they came in the form of BUSD so I'll show you guys the back office in a little bit here uh, start with the hunter right earn 20% rewards up to 20% rewards depending on which crypto it is and or token and then you withdraw your BUSD monthly. All right, so their rewards program, fast start, residual, token, career, all that stuff, right? Fast start bonus. 
You must purchase hundred dollars of night tokens and bring five direct to open up five levels with a minimum of a hundred. Open up level two, you need to bring two active users with at least a hundred. Open up level three, you need three active users with at least a hundred. So you can see how that can easily start to blow up to five levels deep. Right? Just like that. Residual. Earn 2% on monthly earnings of all your active users for, to your fifth depth level as your per your current staking plan. You need to have a minimum of $100 in staking to receive residual income. That's not too hard. $100 minimum. I have $5,000, so I, I open it up to five levels on residual bonus. 10% token bonus. Earn 5% on everyone's tokens on your first level when they stake night. Alright. So stake 25,000 tokens and get 5% extra tokens in your account. When your first level stake, you make 5% extra. And of course, the career trajectories here. Alright. So, as the team builds over time, I have personal stake in a 5,000 right now. So, if I build up team volume up to 5 million, I get a 20,000 bonus. And any other bonus before that, right? It takes time to build all that. But, that's what makes it a legacy is that when they offer career earnings, right? Then they're poised to set this thing up for the long haul. That's what this setup is for when they offer career bonuses. It's because they're set up for the long haul. They want this thing to thrive. All right, so staking rewards withdraw first money of each month. All right, did that two weeks ago. Uh, fi fast start bonus withdraw Monday through Friday. That's on the fast start. So that's when people join in on you. If you have nobody join in on you, then you're just waiting for the stake and rewards withdraw. First money of the month. All right, withdraw fee, 10%. And night tokens. Bonus withdrawal rate, 5%. It's not bad. Minimum withdraw, 50 bucks. And they asked for five business days. And I asked about that, right? I said, hey. You're the only one that puts within five business days. And he said, hey, you know why? It's because if we could do it in 24 hours, we'd do it in 24 hours. But sometimes we're busy. Sometimes it might take 48 hours. Sometimes it might take 72 hours. But this gives us a window to pay it within a time frame that is realistic. And I say, hey, okay, nothing wrong with that. Right? Because it could be less than five days. But they're trying to keep it within five business days uh, just because that's what he <laughs> pretty much said. Hey, sometimes we get busy, you know, and, and things happen. They're not going to be held to the standard of 24 hours or 40 hours. And they just don't have it, you know, in ready yet just because, you know, they've been busy, right? So they said this is more than enough time frame to take care of business. Nothing wrong with that. Network qualifications, we see the numbers there on how that works. Uh, NFTs, just for holding NFTs, you get rewarded 10 to 20% rewards. Play to earn game rewards in stablecoin. Rent your NFTs in the marketplace and earn rentals rewards, which is pretty damn cool. Breed two NFTs to create a unique one. That's damn cool, too. Uh, you could... <laughs> pretty much reproduce NFTs, I guess in a sense, right? Through uh, uh, fake reproduction. <laughs> and you can earn from that too. Man, that's that's pretty cool. I wonder if there's a limit to breeding. <laughs> you know, how many kids can you breed out of this? That would be funny to see. D5 Fair Games? Where to earn? Get rewarded? I mean, you could do it all in this thing. And it all starts with just staking in DeFi night. So other than that, whoa, shit, running out of time. Links down below, comment down below. I'll see you in the next one.